Welcome back to The Sims 4 Five Nights at Freddy's Sister Location theme. And as you can see, all of the kid animatronics are playing together and getting along. And I am very excited about this episode because I get to create a ton of Sims! And by create, I mean I'm going to age up all of the children and make them into their teenage counterparts, which is pretty much gonna look like their adult counterparts, and gives me so much more clothing and hair and makeup to use. So they're pretty much gonna look like uh, totally different Sims. However, I think we need to have a birthday party for all of them. And we also need to capture three more children so that we can turn them into three more animatronic characters. All right, well, I guess it's a little late to have a party for children on a Wednesday night. So I guess we'll wait till tomorrow. Wow, I think Ender just came in here and broke this and then ran away. All right, I finally installed a bathroom. <laughs> they were like peeing all over the outside. See, look at this. I don't understand. The bush wasn't working very well. So look, got them a little. Oh, I got to fix the outside. But yeah, bathroom. I'm sending everybody alone for the day. Go, go, go. And then when you get home, we're going to have a birthday party. Oh, crap. That means we need a... Uh... Oh, you didn't go to school. No, get up. Get up, get up. Go to school. Anyway, like I was saying, that means we need a kitchen so somebody can make a birthday cake. Yay, there we go. Oh, my gosh. Yay. Oh, my God. <laughs> go play hooky dump. If the phones would stop interrupting me, we have a new little kitchen now. Yay. Why do all these little kids have cell phones? Senpai, no. Literally every single one of their cell phone has gone off today while at school. All right, everybody's back from school. Now we can throw a party. All right, Bon Bon, you're like the ringleader here. Let's uh, let's plan a party. Oh, we can't. Fine, Ennard, you gotta do it. Plan social event. Oh, he doesn't know all the kids though. Fine, we're just gonna do, we'll do a birthday party. Birthday sim, I'll use. And during this birthday, we are going to try and kidnap three children. Yeah, I'm not gonna overcrowd it with the old gang. Let's just do the new ones and then we're gonna invite, uh, or the kids are gonna invite their friends. And we're having it here. All right, now Bon Bon, invite to hang out. Oh yeah, plus trap, all the children. Oh, you only know two? Uh-oh, please tell me somebody else knows more. Oh, I think Biddy Bab does, invite. Yeah, here we go. I should really get going. No, 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 no. This is a birthday party. All right, Ennard, we need you to come bake cakes. We need you to bake, like, four cakes. Make a chocolate cake. All the adult animatronics are wearing weird clothes. Oh, God, people are fighting. People are fighting. Circus Baby and Funtime Freddy are fighting. Look at And Belor is just watching. Come on, guys. You're at a children's birthday party. Look, this little girl is judging you. Look at her. She's pissed. All right, how many children do we have here? Do we have three? We have her. I like her. We're gonna we're gonna take her. Add to family. You are officially kidnapped. That's how quick and easy it is. Yay! Plus trap is here. But we can't kidnap him. He's already an animatronic. Uh, oh, this little boy. Let's get him. Add to family. Look how sad he looks. You've been kidnapped. Oh, you. You've been kidnapped. <laughs> you. Uh, wait, wait. Why can't I kidnap you? Crap. We have too many people in our household. We gotta age them up and then get entered out of here. Especially because he keeps breaking all of our crap. Stop, entered. Look what you did, Ennard! Are you kidding me? At a kid's birthday party? You come in here and fix this. There you guys go. Here you go. Look, you made everybody happy. All right, did you make a cake, Ennard? Actually, did you make a cake? Where is it? Ennard, what is this crap? All right, well, I think this episode, we're gonna just have to slowly age them up and then, uh, wow, 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 wow. I hate you. Ugh. Darn dollhouse. Nobody likes it. Come resume the cake. We need the cake. We gotta age up at least one person during this party. Come on. All right, we made a cake. All right, let's put, uh, add birthday candles. Being that Bon Bon was the first one that we made, he's gonna age up first. Blow out candles. I know it's really tiny kitchen, but you could do it. Can you reach? Yay! Happy birthday! <laughs> bon Bon aged up. Uh, Bon Bon, he's pretty mischievous. Let's do chief of mischief. And he's cheerful and, and active. So he runs all around during his sister location. All right, now we can move Ennard back to the other house and kidnap one more child. So let's do that right now. Actually, let's uh, let's age up one more kid while the birthday thing's still going on. Gotta make a cake. Please don't burn down the house. Next up is Biddy Bab. I'm just gonna go in order. Oh, wait, where did this cake come from? Add birthday candles. Oh, it's the same cake. Oh, just keep adding candles to the same cake. We can age up everybody. Come here, blow out candles. Come on, Biddy Bab. Let's see what you look like in teenage form without me doing anything. Oh my God, her ears. Uh, 
Biddy. I guess Chief of Mischief too. She's a goofball and childish because she's Biddy Bab. Look at her ears. Oh God. Oh no. Oh no. All right, here, add birthday candles again. All right, Bonnet's gonna do it next. Yay! Oh gosh, she looks like Infochan. Bonnet, I don't know much about because she's just in the custom night. I'll just keep doing mischief, I guess. She's cheerful and uh, I'll do the same as Bonbon. Bon. All right, add birthday candles. And then the last one, Mini Rena. She's like stick skinny, oh my gosh. Oh, she's singing for me. Yay, Mini Rena. I'm gonna put her as a party animal actually because <laughs> she likes to dance. She's a dance machine. Oh, she's cute. Eh, I'm gonna be fixing them up in Creative Sim in a minute anyway. Oh wait, I just realized I think we have enough kids. We have three. That's what I needed. I needed three. All right, well time to make these characters look awesome. I love this part of the game.
All right, so I thought it would be easier to create each of them and then go back through them and talk to you guys while I show you their personalities and their names and all that good stuff. So this here is Bon Bon, of course. I went crazy trying to find a red necktie. I could only find them for female. A lot of you pointed out that you can uh, take away masculine and put feminine or put none of them, it'll show you everything. But with modded content, if it's specifically made for females or males, it won't show up anyway. So I did find neckties for the girls, but the guys uh, don't have any. So they're just all gonna have to be black. So to make up for the red that's missing, I gave him a little red bracelet and I decided to do his lower half all white because technically he is Funtime Freddy's puppet. Funtime Freddy is white and his hand is the rest of him. So yeah, and I have something really cute to show you. So a lot of people complain that I don't do their uh, sleep outfit and whenever they're walking around the house and stuff, they're always in their PJs and it's not their original outfit. So some of them, well, I'm gonna go back and try to fix everybody, but some of them have one really cool onesie. <laughs> so not every character is gonna get a onesie. It's only if it matches their animatronic character. So look, it's a blue bunny. And yeah, that's what he's gonna sleep in. And I'll show you the rest when I get to it. And Bon Bon is chief of mischief. He is cheerful and active. You know, cause he's running all around. You gotta try and click him and he's always smiling and see. All right, moving on. This one's a little weird, but I mean, his actual animatronic is really weird looking. So just stick with me. The rest of them, look much cuter, but this is Yendo. <laughs> so he is like a grayish, blackish color. So I gave him that skin color and it turned out kind of brownish grayish. I found this cool face paint that shows he's got like the gears, but I couldn't find any full skin of him being like robot wires and whatnot. And then I gave him this hair because I didn't want to stick his ears out to the side to simulate the little ears he has. So uh, I had to do this weird man pigtail bun style. And I did the same thing I did with Ennard where I gave him all the wraps that kind of simulate like wires and just made him gray. And then I gave him crisscross shoes to simulate wires. So yeah, this is Yendo. Oh, I didn't pick his stuff. All right, I just put Chief of Mischief like everybody else. Insane, cause he's a little creepy looking. His animatronic, I mean, he's, he looks all right. And a loner because he uh, he's just an endoskeleton. He doesn't have his suit, which makes him sad and alone. I don't know. Oh, and yes, Yendo has a cute sleep outfit. Look how cute he is. Look. So it's kind of like his endoskeleton is actually in uh, in a suit. He looks like he's supposed to be a bear. And look, it makes him happy. <laughs> so yeah, that's Endo. And then we have LOL Bit or LOL Bit. She was super cute to make. I wish I could change the color of the little uh, circle blush things to purple, but I can't. So that's as close as we can get. Then I gave her purple lipstick, but because of the robot overlay, it faded it a little bit. But then I found this purple cute necktie bow tie. I added some more purple with the purple skirt and purple shoes and she's got her tail. She's so cute. And she has cute sleepwear too. I know it's a cat and not a fox, but you know what? It's close enough and she looked really cute. But yeah, I really like that she allowed me to use my cool animatronic eyes and lol bit or lol bit. I am not gonna know how to say her name. She is chief of mischief as well. She is cheerful because of the lols and a goofball for the lols. I, I don't know guys. I like her, she's one of my favorites now. Next is Bonnet. So for some reason, a lot of you hate when I put girls in very short hair. I don't know why, I think they look super cool. But this one is justified. I wanted to model her exactly after Bon Bon because they are like the same exact thing, but just a different color and in The Sims, a different gender. So I took the same exact hair and gave it to her. I found a red bow tie. I wanted to give her pretty lashes, but it won't let me do it with the ears at the same time. I gave her just a little black super crop top because all she really has is a black button on her character. And then I gave her the same white pants and white shoes as Bon Bon to simulate that she is also a puppet, I believe. And Bonnette is also chief of mischief. She is cheerful and active just like Bon Bon's. They're like the same character. And of course, Bonnet also has 
this cute sleep costume. Look at it. She's a little pink bunny. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. All right. So I originally made Biddy Bab to look like this, an adult version. However, after I filmed and edited all that, The Sims decided to put out a toddler update. And I want an excuse to try and play with some toddlers. So I saved what I did to make them adults so that we can use them in the future when I age them up. But I think I'm going to change them into toddlers right now. Oh my adorableness. <gasps> Look how cute. Oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my goodness, I underestimated how cute. Oh cool, and when I do teenager, it brings her back to this form. And then when I do toddler, she looks like this. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. I'm not gonna change uh, her appearance, actually. I'm just gonna change her outfit so that when I decide to age her up, she ages up properly. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, she's making adorable noises. All right, and this is Biddy Bab. Uh, they didn't have any really tan colored outfits, so I just had to use white, but look, like a tan beige colored bow, close enough. And then I made her skin like that whitish color that Biddy Bab is, and then she's got the like beige tan hair, but there's not much uh, creative content for the toddlers just yet, so this is probably as close as I'm gonna get for now. Oh, the treats are so cute. Ooh, Curious Explorer. Yeah, I think that fits Biddy Bab pretty well. Oh my God, she's so cute. All right, and moving on. Just like Biddy Bab, I'm gonna turn Electro Bab into a toddler, but I wanted to show what he looked like in adult form or teenage form, but let's turn him into toddler. Uh, wait a minute. Oh, that is a boy. It looks like a girl. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, little boy, that I assumed your gender. All right, and I gave him the same exact outfit. Oh my god, he's so cute. They also didn't have yellowish eyes for babies, so I had to give him these like muted color ones for now. And because his character has to do with being shocked, I'm gonna do wild, which is spirited and full of energy, like a battery. <laughs> Perfect. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. And last but not least, my absolute favorite that I made, which I wasn't expecting, Mini Rena. Look how cute she looks. Guys, 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 guys. Look at her, look at her, look at her. Oh my gosh, I can't believe how cute she turned out. I was like the least excited to make her. And then as I started making her, I got the most excited. But I loved this hair since Yandere when I used it for one episode and I knew I had to use it on one of them. I thought it fit her the best because it's kind of like a circular haircut, makes her face circular. And then I got her this ballerina e outfit and she is so awesome. I love her. And she is actually not a chief of mischief. She's a party animal because she's a dancer and she's cheerful because her uh, mask was always smiling and a dance machine. She's so awesome. I love her. Oh, I love her hair. I love her. I love her outfit. I lo just love everything about her. And yeah, this is our second generation Five Nights at Freddy's sister location people. I wonder what's gonna happen amongst them. All right, so before I end this episode, I just wanted to show you that I updated the house a little bit, as you can see. I added a second floor, and I turned it into a teenager paradise, but then, of course, added a spot for the toddlers. So this is the first floor. I'm not gonna pay attention to the toddlers just yet because I want to save that for next episode when I actually get to, oh God, she farted. She farted. I love you so much already. <laughs> She looks like an evil child. But yeah, we will play with them next episode. We've done too much this episode. But yeah, this is the teenage living space. I gave them a kitchen, a bathroom, a dance party area, a gaming area. And then if you go outside and up, I know that's not probably the safest thing for a toddler. Oh, mini Rena. And Electro Bab, oh, this is so cute. Yes, go upstairs and show us the upstairs. I had way too much fun decorating with the uh, new toddler stuff. Look at, it's like rainbow everything. Even the door is rainbow. So yeah, this area is like the potty training area, the eating area, and then this is the fun and sleep area. And I moved that dollhouse up here, so hopefully nobody keeps breaking it. And yeah, that's the new house. And that's gonna be it for this episode. I know you guys are probably bummed that uh, I just added all the new toddlers. You wanna see me play with them? I want to play with them just as much, but we are gonna have to wait until next episode. Oh, also, I decided to change LOL Bits hair, or LOL Bits hair, because there was two white-haired girls and I kept getting them confused. So she's got the purple hair to match her, the rest of her purpleness. 
But yeah, if you like how I made all of the new second generation and third generation, if you count the toddlers, characters, then make sure to leave a like on this video before you go. Leave some comments below giving me some ideas as far as relationships go. I don't know who to ship just yet and any other ideas. And as always, I will see you guys soon.